Hey guys, this is 1UP Indie coming up with my latest project in cooperation with my buddy RGS Dev. So he provided the sprites, the images, and I provided well the whole user interface and the programming. And here, what you can see is basically a sprite or character creation tool for different kind of states with different kind of pieces. So you can customize it the way you like. And of course, you can go dual wielding if you like. So let's go for some dual wielding right arm sweet and let's go for attacking so everything is possible in this thing and of course the main idea is to customize it with your own uh, sprites which you want to use and then give it different kind of colors so this is the idea let's give a pink shield and then you can export it as a png as a strip or as a single or single sprite so let's say we want to save it let's say in here so we just go to your, into your folder structure and then I don't know give it a name bbbbb and see that the sprites are being created and boom here you go as single sprites so this is the thing what it is made for basically you can create your own thing so your own character with different kind of animation and then you can use it in game which is hopefully a, good, a thing which you guys actually like so not sure about it. I didn't see a proper tool like that anywhere. So I just thought like, hey, let's uh, take the opportunity and make this one. I had the idea a few years ago, but here comes the but. I never had a good basis on it. I never had the good sprites, but now I have them. So therefore, thanks to RGS and develop, uh, Dev, where we did this in cooperation, of course, we will split the profits of this one so if you want to get hold of this i would say end of the week i am pretty much finished so this is on 0.85 so we are almost finished with that thing i'm gonna add here a few uh, custom color swatches which you can save so here you can customize it a little bit further besides doing all the colors in here and of course i wanted to do an outline function so basically you have an outline around the player and maybe even a glow outline with different kind of colors and then i guess this is all you can do so here you you have tons of options and then <laughs> this actually looks pretty neat so uh, then you can uh, do whatever you like and therefore of course you can customize it even further if you like to so here once again a very 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 powerful tool in my opinion and for that well i had to break game maker a little bit because game maker studio is sandbox so saving in a custom folder is kind of uh, with a standard version impossible so i had to tweak a little bit uh, with the engine which uh, prevented me for one week to actually achieve this so that was kind of a hard nut to crack but i did so here once again you see the result so without further ado i don't know should i play around with that not so sure let's give him address <laughs> or this one so basically you can do quite a lot of things with it and of course you can play around so if you're having some other ideas which you see like hey i would like to see that in uh, the basic uh, version of this character's um, creation tool then give me a comment below that would be a, a, a much 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 appreciated and then i can if it's not too big in implement and of course my idea with this one is not that this is then a standalone thing and then boom i toss it away i would like to use it modular because i build it like that and that means i can reuse it for different kind of purposes so let's say i am creating later on let's say some packs for let's say just for vikings then I have in different kind of bodies and so on and then boom i will uh, make a different kind of versions and then you can um, grab all of them also so i want to build this as a as a tool for multiple purposes and of course i will use it for the something else which i already have in plans but eh, not gonna talk about this today so without further ado that was pretty much it from my side the usual Hotline Miami tutorial series will continue today also, so you'll get two videos in one day. So hopefully you uh, like what you're seeing because it took quite uh, some time to build it and uh, hopefully this is a tool which you will guys use quite a lot. So have a good one and see you in the next devlog and of course today in Hotline Miami.